every Danette should have a question for me. Fritzy, you're first. Which team in the upcoming season will show the biggest improvement in each conference and who's taking a giant step backward? Ooh, good question, Fritzy. That's, that's a very broad question. Biggest improvement? Um, it's got, you know, your best bet there is to go to the draft and teams that were really terrible, right? Because they've got the greatest chance to improve then. Dallas Cowboys 4-12 and 12 last year. Yeah, I mean, probably Dallas Cowboys, but does that count, Fritzy? I mean... Are I they really improving, that. or is he just is just Romo healthy? That's a that's a that's a tough question to answer. Um, I would tell you that I think that the Jaguars and the Raiders have a great chance to win their divisions. I think the Jaguars and Raiders have a great chance to win the division. I'll give you another one. You want a little surprise thrown at you, Fritzy? Sure. I think there's a pretty decent chance the Minnesota Vikings go to the Super Bowl. Really? How about that? Dun dun dun. <laughs> Minnesota Vikings go to the Super Bowl. All right, here's my question. Of the four West Coast teams, Oakland Raiders, San Diego Chargers, Los Angeles Rams, and San Francisco 49ers, which ones make the playoffs? Seattle's not a West Coast team? I'm going to, I'm sorry, California teams. Yeah, I'm just messing Good with call. You. No, that's such a jerk move by me. Sorry, I did the, the time zone thing. It's payback. By the way, I'm glad you mentioned that. I had several people on Twitter say that if they hear an hour later, they would have thought behind as well. An hour later, an hour behind. Mm, fair. Semantics. Well, several people on Twitter would definitely confirm something like that. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> your people. Hey, what was your question? I totally forgot. All right. Which California team will make the playoffs? Rams, Chargers, Niners, uh, Raiders. Oh, Raiders. No one else? No. Who, who do you think? Niners are going to be terrible. Rams were 7-9, and nine, but do they go back a, a notch because... When they switch to Jared Goff? I think Goff. they're 7-9 and nine at best. I think the Rams are 7-9 and nine again at best. We're not going 7-9 and nine again this year. I'm not going 7-9. and nine. Having a girl in your dorm is 7-9 and nine stuff. How about 8-8? Eight and eight? Yeah. McLovin, what do you got? Um, okay. Who will select Deshaun Watson with the number one overall pick next season? Oh, that's easy. Cleveland Browns. With the number one overall pick in the 2017 NFL Draft, the Cleveland Browns select Deshaun Watson. Yes, yeah, Seton. Well, this is coming from a place specifically I want to ask about one player, but I'll try to make it more interesting to everyone else in the world. So I'll say, do you have your eyes on a sort of breakout player this year? Uh, and what do you think of Kevin White with the Bears? What kind of season? Man, you know, the best thing you can do at this time of year is to kind of look at the reports. And Kevin White's a freak, but I still think – that he's he's it's learning to the point where I don't know that he'll be a breakout. Um, that's a good question, though. Some of the rookies you're already hearing good things about. How about Sterling Shepard from the Giants? He's already starting. He's ac uh, across from Odell Beckham Jr. You know, I, I think Sterling Shepard's a pretty good one in terms of a breakout rookie. I'll tell you, I'll give you another breakout guy, Tyler Lockett with the Seahawks. I think will be a breakout guy. The Dan Patrick Show, weekday mornings on Audience.